Um, I'm focusing on hot foods right now, and a head office, corporate head office sends us um, the results for daily, monthly, weekly results. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm a perfectionist, and I try to strive for perfectionist <laughs> in both the store and my staff. And uh, that just goes to show that we make number one in Canada right. for pizza sales. And how Thanks, Nelson. <laughs> <laughs> and how often are products being delivered to the store? Can that be changed by the manager? We have regular deliveries um, coming into the store. I cannot change delivery. It is done through corporate. Mm -hmm. um, the only thing that I have control over is what inventory I am actually ordering into the store. Mm -hmm. We do have shortages through the manufacturer that sends us our orders. So there's certain items that we just have no control over what we get shorted or not. But we do get um, reports with that are telling us why it is that we're shorted whether it's delisted or whether it is um, a product they no longer carry, or maybe it's a product that's been recalled. Uh, so at a store level, we don't have any control over that, but we are aware of the shortages and we do look into them. Okay. There are some products that we have to carry, um, you know, in the grocery section, such as mayonnaise and ketchup and mustard. Whether they sell or not, they're a mandatory thing to have in store. Yeah. We do have other areas in the store where we can do a retail initiative mm -hmm. and um, you know here in Nelson we have a lot of organic eating people vegetarian people mm -hmm. we can uh, make a retail initiative and bring in those kind of items